The Clash of Clans Builder looks on as another attack sees his work torn apart. The Barbarians laugh and joke even though they failed to defend the village. This happened again and again and again. Despite this, the Builder had faith that the team could work together and enter legend status. So he repaired, built and improved defences, working a total of 1.8 trillion hours. But did anyone care? The sheep, instead of practicing attacks, would mess around with Builder Hoods and irritate him even more. Over the years, the team had become too reliant on the Builder and a sugar rush from the 5th Clashiversary cake sent them running wild. The builders decided that in order to bring order back to the village, chaos needed to be made, and with the help of some spring traps, left. The hierarchy of the village were furious. What kind of a prank was this? Leaving the base defenseless? The hog rider suggested putting the town hall on the outside. Perhaps attackers would leave the rest of the base unscathed. That's a crazy idea, replied the head wizard. We have to repair the base and get the builder back. Any ideas? After hours of discussion, it was decided that the barbarian was their best chance. He needed to get to the master builder who had contacts with the builder. So the hog rider and wizard helped him to pluck up the courage and get across those shores. Whilst the rest of the barbarians got to work upgrading the base. It didn't take them long to realize just how hard the builders had worked to create the world they live in. And as they tirelessly smacked the Grand Warden and Queen in order to toughen them up, all they wanted was a little bit of appreciation, but the villagers walked right on by, not even giving them a single clap. The harsh reality and urgency to get the Builder back set in. But where was the Builder? Well, first off, the Builder decided to take a little bit of time for himself and jetted off to Japan. But the villagers would have a mountain to climb if they wanted to win him back. As the Builder, along with the help of the Master Builder, had a cunning plan and managed to loan for a limited time the Battle Ram from Clash Royale to spy and keep a check on the village. But the Builder ended up having too much fun in Japan, South Korea, would he even come back? What started as a simple prank escalated and the Builder lost touch with why he even left in the first place. He even started advertising as a free agent for work. Had he forgotten about gems? He wanted to build things, not tear them down. As long as we yell Builder, he should come running. Perhaps if we could complete some sort of challenge, we could prove to the Builder that the party is over and we're ready to attack for Legends League. Will he come back? Only time will tell. This is a fictional, fan-created, parody video story. The Builder may or may not return to Clash of Clans. Make sure to comment with your ideas to help the Builder come back and leave a like if you enjoyed the video. This content is not affiliated with, endorsed, sponsored, or specifically approved by Supercell, and Supercell is not responsible for it.